He didn't have a heart. But he still got up. The page predicted all of it. It helped me fight him. Oh, oh, oh. He, he just disappeared? What the hell is going on here? We need to figure that out if we're gonna do anything about it. Somehow we need to make sense of this. There is no rational explanation to what we just saw. Oh. I'd love to blame this on mass hallucination caused by inhaling volcanic gas, but we both know that's bullshit. This was supernatural. Well, I'm glad you were the one to say it. Now we can figure out a way forward. Right before things got crazy, Sheriff Breaker just vanished. Maybe the sheriff knew more than he was letting on. Hmm. He seemed anxious, like he dreaded what was coming. One more mystery. The victim of a ritualistic murder turns into a monster. Is there a connection? It looks to me like the cult of the tree is performing rituals to create monsters. Hmm, maybe. We need to start with learning this cult's goal, their purpose. There's one of the pages on the floor. Saga was back at Cauldron Lake. Saga had to pursue Nightingale into the overlap. Finding a way in would be difficult. A ritual. Saga would learn how. Stop the monster. Gosh. This is a lot. The autopsy room was a mess, like a bomb had gone off. Nightingale hunted Saga, didn't see her under the light, lurched past her. The Taken could not see into bright light. The light hurt them, hurt the darkness in them, made them vulnerable. I flick the switch, it goes click. Show me the clicker, lights are off, but somebody's home. Hemingway brought you here, witch, get out of my house, Nightingale shouted. A wave of terror crashed through Saga's head. The awful truth. Nightingale had no heart in his chest, but here he was, killing a monster. The world had lurched out of balance. You found yourself trapped on the far side of the mirror. Okay. Investigate, investigate, you've got to investigate. What are we looking at? My God. A dead man turned into a monster. Pretty weird. Right, as a way to fight him. Pages predicting the future. There's Possibly. no rational explanation. Not at all. This is the case we must solve. <laughs> Sounds exciting, doesn't it? Ooh. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Where's the overlap? Mm hmm? Think, Saga. Goals, goals, goals. Figure out where Nightingale went. Have a look round then. It 
doesn't budge. In a second, what about in here? Oh, now we've got some items in the old inventory. I have to get them there. Must be locked from the other side. Okay. The page places Nightingale back at Cauldron <clears throat> Lake. Calls him a Taken. We need to head over there, stop him, before anyone else gets hurt. Okay. We, we heard gunshots, y'all okay? Did you uh, get spooked by the bodies? Yes. Sheriff Breaker disappeared. Nightingale turned into some sort of a monster, and there are offices down. You two handle things here. We need to get back to Cauldron Lake immediately. Fuck me. That's terrible. We'll do what we can, man. Okay. But that's crazy, right, Thorne? Nightingale's heart was missing. How could he do anything? He's dead. Yeah, right. Well, that's all crazy talk. Monsters aren't real, and what do you mean the, the sheriff disappeared? Evidently, the they are. Like magic. Magic's not real. No, Thor. Monsters aren't real, and magic is definitely not real. I'll get through there then. Oh, this is that I need bolt cutters. Why don't you just ask him, Mike, that you um, might let you in. You're all part of the FBI. Mm, they're a fine pair. Thanks. <laughs> you cheeky bugger. Oh dear. I am a tourist, and it appears that I'm lost in the woods. You've only had a tour guide, also. Bear season. Uh, what is that? No, a bear. Uh, <laughs> Help. Brilliant. Help. No! Did somebody call for a tour guide? Oh, wow. Koskala Brothers Adventure Tours. Unforgettable tour experiences at affordable prices. That's right. I'm Il Mokoskala, voted best coffee roaster slash tour guide by Coffee World magazine. And I'm here to give you the tour of a lifetime. But Ilmo, I've heard the government has seized and restricted access to many local nature attractions. That is true, Yanko. Many local attractions have recently become fenced off by the government. And that's why at Koskala Brothers Adventure Tours, we say, fuck the government. Fuck oh, the government. We have bolt cutters. Oh, wow. They've got bolt cutters. You think of everything. And we'll take you anywhere. Ha <laughs> ha, yes. Hiking through the scenic Elderwood National Park. Fishing in the crystal clear waters of Bright Falls Dam. Bird watching at Majestic Mirror Peak. Tour of a lifetime is just one phone call away. Book now to get a 9% discount on this limited edition Oh Dear Diner Coffee Thermal. Brilliant. I love it. I love it. Thank you for watching. Oh, who's this? Hello? Not going to talk to me, alright. Neither are they. Hello? 
My client has been held here long Nightingale and his cult are dangerous. We need to be prepared in case things Just escalate more than they already have. Right Can you call it in, Casey? A smart choice, Anderson. Yeah, Agent Casey here. Yeah. We need backup. The Bright Falls case. Whoever you can spare. ASAP. Think we'll actually find Nightingale at the lake? The pages haven't been wrong yet. We can't assume the person writing these pages isn't playing us. I agree. But it's our best lead. I'm gonna take a quick look around. Meet you back at the car. See you in a bit. Where is the car? I've lost the car. Who is more voiture, s'il vous plaît? See you around. All right. Where's my car? That concludes our debate on whether pets should be allowed at this year's bake sale. Just now. Just like why did we park all the way back here? Not fast travel, but. Come on, let's go. Have a nice day. And you. Look how beautiful this game looks. Where is my car? Why have you parked it all the way over here, you silly woman? Oh, he's taking a different way. Well, I guess you win. Did you check out the town, Anderson? Just getting my bearings. Ready to go? Waiting on you. I didn't really do a lot in the town. There's nothing to do with that. Uh, rinse go on, let's go. Clock out, get a beer. Or maybe three. Where's the little monster? I need to come clean, Anderson. I know why Nightingale was here 13 years ago. He was chasing a writer, Alan Wake. Tammy mentioned him. Oh, Alan. She's writing a book on his disappearance. You know the detective character from his books, Alex Casey. Yeah, I've heard the jokes at the office. Cold case Casey. Murder case Casey. <laughs> Sorry. Ha <laughs> ha. It's the same name, similar job. It's the first thing anyone thinks of. It annoyed me, but that was it. Then, ten years ago, I started getting strange letters in the mail. Fragments of prose describing murders. You've heard the stories about what happened in New York. Some of it, at least. Bodies started to pile up. It was a murder cult. Turns out the fragments sent to me were from the crime books of Alan Wake. The cult was copycatting the murders from the books. In their heads, they were performing a ritual to bring Wake back. Their imagined prophet. After that case, I started looking into Wake's disappearance on the side. And you thought this case might be connected to him? His name does keep popping up. I just wanted you to have all the facts. Next time, give them to me before we find ourselves in the middle of a horror story. Who's is that van? Somebody's here. Gosh. Back to the lake. The page says Nightingale's in something called an overlap. Need to figure out exactly what that means. I'm happy I'm not in charge of this mess. Thanks. Let's start looking for Nightingale where he was killed. Mr. Nightingale. The of these pages knows what will happen. Because they're behind this, or because they can see what's coming. Impossible things are happening here. A world operating on different rules. I need to understand this strange logic. To I'm glad you remember the way, because I can't. Solve the case. 
That's like it. Look at that. Look at that. The, oh, the sun's setting. So wonderful. I've been thinking more about the cult of the tree. What sort of cult refers to themselves as a cult? It's like not nature. They don't. We're hmm. not seeing the full picture yet. Oh, who are these guys? What's that noise? Hey, hello there. How are you folks doing? Those restricted me on the side. Don't do a damn thing, huh? Oh, don't hello. put your gun at him. Saga Anderson. Are you don't just supposed shoot to be him, here? I'm Ilmo Koskela. Fantastic to meet you. And yes, ah, here hired me to show him through the woods. The guy from the um, advert on TV. Business. Fixing this impressive piece of hardware. I work for the FBC, ma'am. I'm authorized to be here. And I bet you two are here about that murder. Nasty stuff. How's it going? How did you hear about the murder, Elmo? He's the guy that says, You know anything that can help us? People tend to tell me things. The Koskala brothers are kind of a household name around here. Speaking yep. of, uh, if you're looking for some fun, stop by Watery. Just down the road from Bright Falls, there's our Coffee World Amusement Park. There's Sauna, Sauna de Vista. <laughs> and we offer a variety of guided tours, hunting, fishing, hiking, whatever strikes your fancy. You name it, you probably got it. A bit of hiking. What is this thing? It's just a monitoring station, ma'am. The Federal Bureau of Control checks volcanic activity and air toxicity levels. No need to worry, though. It's mostly for research purposes. That's one gorgeous wetter saga. <laughs> Looks Nordic. I bet a family member made it. Stephen, we're investigating a murder that occurred nearby. What can you tell me about your bureau? Nothing that isn't classified, I'm afraid. But I don't know anything about a murder. Operations here are run by a different department. I'm just here to make some repairs. The wiring on this thing frays every couple months. Yep, that's the raccoons. They grow real big here with teeth like you wouldn't believe. Can not run through a garbage can. My mother made this sweater for me. How do you know? I knew it. My mom used to knit those sweaters for me and my brother. Watery. My hometown was founded by Finnish immigrants. So between your name and the sweater, I figured your family might be from Finland too. Suomi, Finland. Ulla, Karjalan Close. My mom's family is from Sweden originally. I don't know much about them beyond that. The sweater is just something to remember her by. Well, Christmas sweater. I need to get back to it. It's a Christmas sweater. Come on. Let's get to the murder site, Casey. Leave them to it. Look at the beautiful scenery. A lot of things about this case Wonderful keep bothering trees. me. But one thing feels really off. Breaker's disappearance. Oh yeah, he just I don't get the feeling Nightingale was responsible. Hmm, he was about to give you more of those pages. He was. Something didn't want us to have them? Or was protecting him from Nightingale? Spontaneous combustion? I don't know what. Not the kind of disappearance we normally solve. Ah, uh, here we go. This is where his body was Our found. There's lots of water down here now. I never mind it rain. Feels like cold. No sign of Nightingale. But the page did place him at Cauldron Lake in an overlap. So how do we follow him there? Maybe something around here will tell us. Red at night, Shepherd's Delight. Look at that. Just look at the wonderful sky. Right. We've Ooh. seen this symbol before. Hmm. Good eye. What else are we looking for? Out 
After we find Nightingale, what then? I've never arrested a monster. I've watched you arrest plenty of monsters, Anderson. You know what I mean. Monster monsters. Light worked against him at the morgue. That might be the only way to stop him from hurting anyone else. Monsters? Overlaps? Rituals? What do you make of all of this? Mm -hmm. The killers are usually the ones performing the ritual, not the detective. Acting out their sick fantasy. They may be trying to get you involved, forcing you into their twisted world. But with dead men coming alive, the word ritual starts to have more weight behind it. We need to look around, learn what this ritual is. You're not wrong. Too much of the case board as we do have. Oh look, television. Oh no. dear, I am a tourist, and it appears that I'm lost in the woods. If only had a tour guide, also, bear season. <laughs> <laughs> no! No! <laughs> There he is. For a tour guide. Oh wow. Koskala Brothers Adventure Tours. Unforgettable tour experiences at affordable prices. That's right. I'm Ilmo Koskala voted best coffee roaster slash tour guide by Coffee World magazine. And I'm here to give you the tour of a lifetime. But Ilmo, I've heard the government has seized and restricted access to many local nature attractions. That is true, Yako. Many local attractions have recently become fenced off by the government. And that's why, at Koskala Brothers Adventure Tours, we say, Fuck the government! Fuck the government! We have both cutters. Oh, wow. You think of everything. And we'll take you anywhere! Hiking through the scenic Elderwood National Park. Fishing in the crystal clear waters of Bright Falls Dam. Bird watching at Majestic Mirror Peak. The tour of a lifetime is just one phone call away. Book now to get a 9% discount on this limited edition Oh Dear Diner Coffee Thermal. <laughs> Excellent. Well done. Triangle carving on the table, so that's gonna go to up here. Yeah. Oh. Go to one of these somewhere. Here we go. Symbols. There we go. I think that's all of them until we got from there. Um, whoops, no, I need the goals. Oh, not the yes trail around the crime scene. <laughs> Alright, what else are we looking for? Ah, footprints, here Barefoot. we go. Nightingale. I'll see where these footprints lead. Can you come through the crime scene one more time, KC? Just in case. On it. If anything comes up, I'll radio you. Wonderful. Follow the footprints, Badger. Follow the footprints. Look at that. Have you ever seen anything quite like that before? Right, where's the footprints going? We're going to the right. God. Eerie music. It's 
right in. The tracks uh. lead into the water. Where do you go from here? Who knows? Are we going in the water? <laughs> oh, fucking hell! Fire! Jesus Christ! Nightingale isn't far. Oh. No need for that, was there? What's this? Right, no idea what's going on now. The flipping act. A bit dodgy now. Come on, Badger. Don't be afraid. Alright, we're back here again. I'm not going to read that again. We've done that once. That's the tree. There we go. Is it open? Oh, what is that? What is that? Seems like it's reacting to the light. These aren't the same tracks that were here before. They're headed into the tree, not out of it. Let's have a look then. Oh! My flashlight burned the dark stuff away. It was covering another page. The fuse was in place. Saga stepped into the witch's hut. Pretty weird. Inside, a bright light. There were objects that stood out to Saga. As if the light had manifested them. The witch's hut. Okay. I trust the pages to lead me to the overlap. In that case, we are going to the witch's hut. I know Nightingale is somewhere around Cauldron Lake. The tree was a threshold. This place, and the dark place. <laughs> You're in over your head. Next stop, Caldera Street Station. The threshold, like a doorway, leading to Nightingale. It's somehow connected to a tree, which is ladle. Hmm. A minute, what have we got? Nightingale. Go for the tree into some other place. Oh. Oh, I'm gonna sack. Where do I put this then? Oh, here we go. Where did my girl go? Here we go. Mm -mm. We can all go down there. Is Witch's Ladle the doorway into the overlap? If so, that's where I'll find Nightingale. The Witch's Hut. Light is the key. Okay. To stay safe. But for something more to be revealed as well. Hmm. Alright, we need the witch's hut. Where's the witch's hut? Just there. What's this red stuff here? Like a dead end. Alright, let's go find the witch's hut. I need to find the witch's hut. Come to the witch's hut. Run, run, run. 
Ah, so I wonder if it's that place where you can jump up. Oh, I'm going to say it came from up here, didn't we? Did we? No? Ah! Shit. Where's the path then? There's the path. That's it. And then up here. I think this takes me to the witch's hut. This is the witch's hut. Anderson, right. I thought I saw something in the woods. Probably just a deer, but I'm gonna check it out. Okay. I found another page. Following up on a lead. Keep checking in. Roger. The fuse box is missing a fuse. I need to find one to turn on the lights. This fuse is busted. Near something. What's this? Mitch told me today that his family's moved away. This sucks. I haven't even told her to like it yet. What's the point anymore? Blah blah blah. So I told her she'd fucking kill me. Look at this one again. Went to the big house by the lake instead of just watching it from here. Like I always do. So I just sit around like I always do. Screw that. Anyway, something weird is going down there. I'm going to find out what. I'm back there tomorrow with better gear. I bet I can find a way inside the building. Take some photos. It's going to be epic. Okay. This one looks good. People should really stop littering, though. Yep, they should indeed. The old cabin in the woods. How do we get in? Here we go. Oh! Coffee thermos. Oh, look. There's some bread. Quick save, manual save. Well, that's good. We've got to Another save page. game, so that means we can Making progress. save it here and the image of the finish for the side. evening. Saga addressed the witch. The smudged line on the heart. The second part recited from memory. I brought you the heart, witch. Show me the terror. Saga pushed the heart through the hole in the sign. I need to go to the case board. Right, what we're looking at. Golden Lake Witch's Hut. The page from the Witch's Hut seems to be describing some kind of ritual. Of course, we are in Alan Wake, Alan Wake 2. And this is Chapter 2. Turn the page talking about a ritual of the Witch's Lake. Is this I'm not even past. Is that the entrance to the overlap? Who knows? <sighs> To get into the overlap, I need to find Nightingale's heart, read the line imprinted on it, plus the line on the page to the witch's ladle sign, then push the heart through the hole in the sign. Nightingale's heart disappeared from the morgue. Where is it now? Josh. Track Nightingale performed the ritual to open the overlap. Find Nightingale's Mrs. Missing Heart. Oh, we're done in there, we're done in there. Dip there, dip there. Witch's Ladle. Towering over Saga. Watching her and the witch. The image of the witch in the sign. Nightingale's heart, a cold, dead lump in her hand. 
Her definition of sanity had changed since she arrived in this town. But she trusted the pages. Was forced to. Saga addressed the witch. She squinted to read the first part of the ritual words. The smudged line on the heart. The second part recited from memory. The words she had read on the page. I brought you the heart, witch. Show me the terror. Saga pushed the heart through the hole in the sign. This was the key. The tree was the threshold. Okay. I need Nightingale's heart to get to the overlap. Where is it? The cultist leaned close. He was there, but he was risen. Nightingale was there. The opposite of sunspots. Who said that? That's not it. I don't have what I need to find Nightingale's heart. There must be more. Nightingale's heart. Where is it? Meanwhile, they played cards in the general store. The witch had stolen his heart. Get out of my house. Nightingale's heart is at the general store, in a fridge. Wonderful. Well, I'm glad she worked that out because I wouldn't have had to have a wouldn't have had a clue. Oh, uh, we've seen that. I'm not watching that again. I need to check the general store for the heart. Right, come on then. Casey, I'm headed to the general store. I think I know how to get into the overlap. Uh, Roger that. I followed some ATV tracks in the woods and got a bit turned around. Did you get lost? I've only been lost once in my life, Anderson. The years I spent with my ex-wife. I'll find my way back, don't you worry about it. Right, so we're going back to the general store. How the hell do we get back to the general store? We've got a map, but... Come on, you're kidding me. Obtain a break room fuse box. Point of interest. General store. Right, so... The general store's still in the woods. Let's keep going this way. Keep going. Good evening, Great Bella Fire. How are you this evening? Are you well? This is horrible. Ah, the general store. Here we are. We're looking for a heart in the general store. Um, right, come on. Whoever. So much reading to do. So much reading to do. I'm loving the game. We like a bit of Alan Wake, we do. We've waited for years for this. Many, many years. I've just been fine tuning it to run nicely. And also stream nicely at the same time. I've spent most of the evening pissing about. And now my battery's about to die on my iPad. Of course, I'm also waiting for Robocop to come out tomorrow. Come on, where's the heart? Oh, no, 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 no. What's that? We don't need no scary monsters. Hey, oh, flipping eight! Fuck yes! Talk of a flashlight boost to burn through the darkness around an enemy. Fucking hell! All right, who is that, and where the hell did he come from? 
trauma pad. A trauma pad. Control. Flip. Ah. Uh. Okay. Got yeah. There we go. Right, who's this dude? And what is that noise? There. There, here we go, look. That's it, okay. I'm guessing that's his heart. Yes! Yes! Take it. The text on the heart is clearer now. Ah, ah, ah. Um. So many buttons. I don't usually play flat, flat screen games. But for this, I have taken off my headset. Right, what do we got? Ooh, here we go, we've got the words. We're gonna chant those words. Sounds literary. But what does it mean? Oh we got that, we got that already. I don't need to put that down there. Maybe I skipped ahead just a little bit there. Whoops. Um Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Hopefully it sounds okay and the microphone's okay because I've been messing around once again, as we always do. Right, I've got the heart, so now I need to perform the ritual to open the overlap. We don't need to go in there anymore then, do I? Get out. So many buttons. So many complications. Nightingale's heart. Where is oh, I don't need to do that. I've just done that. Stop it. They played cards in the general. Skip that. Had stolen his heart. Get out of my house. Skip that. No. Alright, where we going? Come out of there. We've got the heart. I feel like I recognize this. The fridge. The heart. I knew it would be here. Like I saw it in a dream. That's right, just pick it up in your hands. Don't worry about gloves or anything. We don't need gloves to pick up hearts, and do we? I need to give the heart to the witch. Makes total sense. Not before we've looted the place. There happens to be lots of ammo lying around. It's never a good sign. Ah, go on then. Let's read the manuscript page. Saga edged toward the broken door. Oh, Alan. Ready. Flashlight aimed ahead. We love you, Alan. Nightingale said it would be here. The Cauldron Lake General Store was overgrown. Left to rot. Saga thought about the cult of the tree. They'd been here. Waiting. Planning a gruesome ritual murder. Meanwhile, they played cards in the general store. Like it was just another late night poker game. Saga stepped closer to the door. Had the animal broken it? There was a loud crash. Saga found herself face to face with a cultist. A yes, the graphics are good. Raincoat. They are good. We watch I'm him in the night. An wild eyes behind a plastic deer mask. An axe in his raised hand. see, of course. But it eats it alive. There's so many settings. Look at all these settings. So many options. Look at this. We've had to use DLAA, DLSS. And I've just changed that. I want to stick that there. There we go. And then we've got all these. I've gone for a quality preset of high. And I've turned ray tracing down to medium and path to trace indirect lighting to medium. How about that? Enough to blow your mind. Send you mental. What grew bigger? What? What's that? Ah! 
I nearly missed that. Come on, let me have it. Check with Lady Fortuna at the counter. Okay. Counter of the general store. Where is the counter? I'm assuming that will be the counter. I've got a bad feeling I'm going to get hurt in a minute. Yes, yeah, the PC world, it's interesting. I've been back in the PC world for 15 years, I think. There we go, what we got, don't forget, update code. Okay, what we're guessing then, all of these is going to be the code. That's going to be a phone number. Winning lottery ticket. 705-773-717-723. Let's hope they forgot the code and used 723. Because other than that... I cannot see anything. I'm going to try that. Might have to just try them all. Get lucky. Go with 723. I'm already on 723. It's not that one, then, is it? That was the last code. So in that case, there must be some sort of clue there. What am I missing? Puzzle games. We just love puzzle games. Okay, 705, 713, 717, 723. Give us a clue. This can be a case of how stupid can Badger look this evening by not knowing what they're going to change the code to. I was never. <laughs> Come on, give us a clue. O five one three one seven two three seven three nine. Look at that! It's the the S. It's the ticket numbers from the lottery. There we go. Seven three nine. Seven three nine. Remember that. Seven three. Nine. Ha ha ha! Yes! Go on! Ha ah, ha ha ha! I've got myself a lovely little gun. Look at that! <laughs> you beast! Quick slot weapons inventory. Can you. Or you can also quick slot healing items. Preferable weapons control. How do I quick slot that then? Quick slide, come on, tell me how. Equip. Ah, so uh, there we go, quick slot. We put that up there then. Quick slot that. There. There we go. I don't know how to get to the quick slot though. Right, so we've got the heart. We've got a new gun. Everything is hunky dory. I'm not reading that again, I can't be arsed. Casey, there are cultists in the area. They're taken, like Nightingale. 
Watch yourself out there. Yeah, thanks for the heads up. I'm still finding my way back. You have the worst sense of direction. <laughs> Any city in America I can get through drunk and blindfolded. It's these damn yeah. trees. Okay, okay. I'm en route to Witch's Ladle. I need to perform a ritual to open the overlap. This case just keeps getting weirder. But it is exciting. Witch's Ladle, Witch's Ladle. Who air the Witch's Ladle? That's Witch's Hut. Witch's Ladle's down there, so I've got to go back. Can actually go past the... Can I go down here? This map's not making much sense. Okay, I don't want to go up there anyway. That. I think I can get down there. All right, let's try it. Come on, let's get to some scariness. Oh yeah, I went through this before, didn't I? Did I? No, I didn't go this way before. Look at that. Isn't that amazing? Look at the water. It does look incredibly good. Take it, that was... I've gone the wrong way. How have I gone the wrong way? Well, this is quite easy to get lost in. Here we go, down here. Can I get down there? Alright, no, let's go and save. That's a good idea. Thank you for reminding me. We can go and do a quick manual save in here, I think. For a quick manual save. Overwrite that one. That'll do. Right, so I can get down here. Here we go. The witch's ladle. I look at the way the trees, look at the way the trees fly about in the wind. So graceful. I think it's so smooth. Just downright scary. What's that noise? Ah, oh, flip, there we go. Oh, what's that? Dodge, dodge, dodge! Which one's dodge? Shit! What's that key gone? I don't even know what that key that is. I can't find it. Help, help, help! It's a space bar, you knob. Oh! Oh! Oh, I'm not doing very well here. This is ridiculous. Right, okay. Come on! Whoa! Down! Okay. Holy shit! Right, so... Alright, one heal, that gets it. Oh, shit man, this is hard work. Why is the thing really light now? Oh, because that light's come on. If I'd have stayed in that light, they probably wouldn't be able to get me, actually. So what is, um... What's my quick slots? I've only got seven rounds of ammo left. Right, I've got some over here I need to look at. I must have missed that. I okay. found the heart in the fridge. Just like the page said I would. We interrupt this program to go into the mind. 
of Saga. Right, carry on. Right, which is Ladle? Where's my torch gone? There it is. Ah, that's what we put in the hole then. Oh, lovely. We're going to chant something as well, are we? Yes, come on then. I'm actually going to wipe hands off that. We've crashed on the far side of the mirror. I brought you the heart witch. Show me the terror. I don't think you really want to see the terror here. <laughs> Holy shit balls! Yes! My sentence exactly! <laughs> Come on! We're going into the overlap. We are going into the overlap. Holy shit! Oh my god! Whoa! What was that? Casey, I think I'm in the overlap. Are you still on your way? To mean defeat Nightingale, I've got Casey. seven bullets. Casey, do you read me? Fuck. I don't think we're in the world anymore. Okay, Saga. Look Go at those. Solo. Look at those leaves. Crisp they are. Well, it stopped raining at least. Oh, I don't like this. I thought Phasmophobia in VR was scary. Logan? Logan! Where are you? What the fuck was that? Yep. Logan's back in Virginia. You're imagining things. I don't need my torch on. Looking for a path, but I can't see one. I'm gonna walk around this rock for a minute. Oh, I've just I've just come out of there, haven't I? Yeah. Get myself a bit lost. Okay, what's this for? Is this path? Looks like a path to me. It looks like a dead end. Not gonna climb up there, are we? What about up there? Can I climb up there? No. Are you kidding? I'm going to walk around the surface for ages here, I reckon. Je suis pour le petit bois. Où est... Où est-vous? Monsieur Nightingale. I don't understand. Let's go back, back, retrace your steps, right, tree. Closed. Hang on a second, maybe I wasn't going backwards. No. Put me back going the same way again, has it? Wait. 
Did I get turned around? Oh, it wasn't me going mad. This is right. It this wasn't me going looping. mad. It is. Like a nightmare. All right, let's shine my torch on that bad boy. Piece of manuscript. Let's see if that's gonna. Need Tell to us find what's the going nightingale. On. Yep. Maybe Alan will tell us what's going on. Read that. Witch's ladle. Towering over Saga. Watching her and the witch. The image of the witch in the sign. Nightingale's heart, a cold, dead lump in her hand. Her definition of sanity had changed since she arrived in this town. But she trusted the pages. Was forced to. Saga addressed the witch. She squinted to read the first part of the ritual words. The smudged line on the heart. The Who's second part recited from memory. The words she had read on the page. I brought you the heart, witch. Show me the terror. Saga pushed the heart through the hole in the sign. This was the key. The tree was the threshold. Yeah, we've already read that one. I thought that was, um... Do I have to go through here again then? Yeah, whoa! What's going on? What's going on? There's something fucking mental about this. Sorry about the language. This is nuts. Yeah, I am too, because this is... <laughs> this crackers. Look at this. I'm guessing red is danger. Oh! Hey! Stop it doing that. No need. I definitely saw something then. Oh no! Well, that's right. I'm trying to be um, a little bit reserved. He's here, Nightingale. Brian. Now I'm lost again. There's too many trees. Um, I've been playing Phasmophobia in VR lately, and that is that scares the hell out of me. It's ridiculous. I think I've put some there's some clips on here somewhere. But what's that? That's the symbol. Oh, come on, this is ridiculous. I can't see anything. Where am I supposed to be going? So we're going down here. What was that? Ah, this is this is too freaky. <laughs> oh my! Imagine this in a VR mod. Oh, oh! Some sort of weird nightmare world. Let's not fall down the waterfall. Come on. Oh no, it's Nightingale. Nightingale was murdered in a ritual. He's a police officer that went missing 13 years ago. Somebody ripped out his heart. And it's my job to find out who did it. In the middle of a biopsy, he got up without his heart in and attacked 
police officers and then ran into this place. What is this? Have you, um, have you got this game yet? Or are you going to get it? I think you should get it. If you like. Oh, come on, I've got seven bullets. Let's try it. Oh, it's knocked me down again. Stop it, you nasty man. Come on. It's not very maneuverable. I don't know, I'm not... Um... Show it, show it to me. That's it, gotta get everything out of there. Yep, yeah, okay, let's get to the next box. Right, no ammo, so that was somewhere down here, I think. Ah, uh, or not. Where is it? Where is it? There it is. This way. Where is he? Where is he? Stop me. That's it. Get away. I'm just going to go this way. Let's get down here. I think I've ended up in the same place again. Just got to keep running, keep running, I think. Getting lost, I'm getting lost. Pocket this way. Where's he gone? Ah! Oh, this is mad. Yes! Come on! <laughs> Gonna need another box. Oh shit!
Come on, get rid of it. Oh my god. This is mental. No ammo. Alright. Flipping heck. No, we're out, we're out. Oh my god, this is driving me nuts. Oh, he's got me again. I don't think we're going to make this. Oh man, I've got no ammo. Probably somewhere I can't get out anywhere either. What do I do now then? There we go. That way. Flipping heck. It's looping, I think. This is so there's infinite ammo. Break the loop. Here we go. I feel like we're back, back somewhere a bit more interesting now. Just in time because I've got to finish at 10 o'clock as well. <laughs> Go on! Brilliant. Alan! Oh, thanks. Who are you? Thanks. <laughs> oh, thank you. What is this? Yes. Who are you? That's pretty hardcore, actually. I'm sorry. It's hard on wait. I can hear you. Calder Blake. Xbox 360 or PlayStation 1 I used to play Alan Wake on. Where are you? Not so many years ago. I to escape. In danger. The dark presence. Danger. My voltage. Thanks. Got it. Alright, please let there be an auto save. Are you okay? No, no, it's my fault. Here he is, the out. man, the legend. With my face, scratch. Sir, calm down. I'm gonna need you to take a breath. He's, he's changed the story. The, the dark presence. We must stop it before. Easy now. First things first. What's your name? My name <sighs> is Alan Wake. Alan Wake. I'm a writer. I, I've been. Wake. Yes. Where did you come from? The lake. You've been missing for 13 years. Yes. Long time. 13. <laughs> oh, that's brilliant. Yes. Yes. Definitely. <laughs> that's wonderful. This is so exciting.
I'd like to carry on and go on to chapter 3, but no. So now we've got a nice little um, end of chapter song. This is madness. So I think tomorrow night we'll be carrying on. We'll just have a sit and listen to this for a moment. my way 